I landed in Pakistan just a couple of hours ago and after doing a little bit of research on where to start my journey, I thought I'd start here. Welcome to Islamabad. <laughs> Pakistan Monument is a national testament to the diversity of the nation's people. Completed in 2007, the artistic design of seven curved petals symbolises unity for Pakistanis. The large overarching petals represent the four provinces in Pakistan. The smaller petals in between represent Kashmir and Gilgit Baltistan. These are the handprints of the labourers who actually built this monument in 2007. So of course the next thing that I'm interested in is the shopping. So I found myself here at Jinnah Supermarket in the heart of Islamabad. Looking around, everything is so beautiful and colourful. I kind of feel a little boring. I think there's something missing. No, no, this is too small for me. This is nice. I think I'll take these ones. Uh, no, the, the pink one. No, there was a pink one. Where did I have this one? And now I know what I'm missing. That's better. Just a small distance away and I found myself in Saipur village, a small town that shows a stark contrast between city and village life. And with the right attire, I think I fit in perfectly. It doesn't stop there. I still have more shopping to do and I'm excited. Would my phone fit in these? You have a big one? I don't know which one to get. I cannot leave Islamabad without visiting the magical Faisal Mosque. Follow me. The Faisal Mosque is one of Pakistan's largest and most visited places, and it's obvious why. The extraordinary structure is a perfect fusion of modern architecture and traditional style. It was designed by renowned Turkish architect Vedat Dalokay, who was selected for the project after winning an international competition. The structure of the mosque resembles a Bedouin tent with its shell-shaped, sloping roofs and its four imperious 90-metre minarets. And it's no surprise that its design was heavily influenced by the Arabian desert. The Faisal Mosque was gifted by the Saudi king, King Faisal bin Abdulaziz, in 1966 during his visit to Pakistan, hence its name. The inside of this mosque is absolutely stunning. It is one of the largest mosques in Asia, 
the prayer hall alone has the capacity to hold up to 10,000 worshippers. It took around 10 years to complete the iconic mosque. And the spectacular view of Islamabad's Margala Hills lends a certain sense of serenity and majesty to the mosque. For one of the smallest cities in Pakistan, Islamabad really has a lot to offer. From arts and culture to food and shopping, safe to say, I think I really enjoyed my time here. Shukriya.